Nigerian Diaspora Investment Summit is set to return to the country for its seventh edition. This year's hybrid event will take place from 5th to 7th November to 7th at the Presidential Villa. Now, our diplomatic correspondent, Ama Marcus, was at the press briefing held by CEO of the Nigerians in Diaspora Commission, Honorable Abike Dabiri Arewa, where key insights were shared about the upcoming summit. Here's the report. Chairman and CEO of NEEDCAM, Honorable Abike Dabiri Erewa, highlighted the importance of the upcoming Nigeria Diaspora Investment Summit. She said since inception in 2018, the NDIS has played a crucial role in job creation, innovation and diversifying Nigeria's economy, impacting key sectors. Now by focusing on investments in small businesses, the summit has contributed to job creation, innovation and the diversification of Nigeria's economic base. Many of these businesses are in sectors such as agriculture, technology, healthcare, manufacturing, and renewable energy, all of which have significant potential to generate sustainable growth. Now, the direct engagement by the diaspora has not only infused much needed capital into the local economy, but has also brought in new skills, knowledge, and global best practices that have strengthened the capacity of local enterprises to compete on a larger scale. And I believe this is very, very significant. The NITCOM bus highlighted partnerships through the NDIS that have significantly boosted the Nigerian economy, such as the establishment of a software engineering campus in Nigeria in collaboration with NITCOM. So as a result of these, of the engagement with the NDIS, ISTEM Labs Africa is currently exploring a promising partnership with NITCOM to establish a software engineering campus in Nigeria. Joining the briefing virtually, Dr. Badewa Adejube Williams, the coordinator of the NDIS, remarked on the summit's proven potential and significance in mobilizing resources that drive economic growth in Nigeria. We are This summit not only strengthens ties between Nigeria and the diaspora, but also paves the way for substantial economic development. Alma Marcus, reporting for ADBN News.